Hi everyone! For this video, I will be showing you how I made this super simple poncho and some outfit ideas. I got two yards of the flannel fabric. You can definitely get fleece or anything you like. I just think fleece or flannel are more soft and you won't need to hem the sides. I started out by laying down the fabric and then I folded in half. Make sure the sides meet. This is important for the cutting part. After laying down the fabric, I just go over to make sure it's smooth and that there are no bumps or huge wrinkles in between. After smoothing out the fabric comes the cutting part. I will be cutting it diagonally, so corner to corner. It is really important that you start cutting from the open-ended corner to the folded corner. I started off by cutting about 4 inches into the diagonal line. Then I folded the fabric corner to corner so I can have a more perfect diagonal cut. After folding the fabric diagonally, I continue to cut on the fold. After cutting the fabric, you will have a big piece and two smaller pieces. I put aside the two leftover pieces and open up the larger piece. You will notice there is a line down the center from the fold. I lined up the two wings of the poncho with the folded line. The line also helps you to determine the center of the poncho. You will also notice that the front of the poncho is not going to line up with the back of the poncho. That is completely okay. The back is supposed to be longer than the front two pieces. After lining the wings along the middle, I fold the top tip of the poncho to create a collar look. This also gives extra room for the neck area. After folding it down, you can either glue it down or sew it down to keep the collar stable. Now about an inch or two away from the collar, you are going to cut a small hole on each side of the poncho. For the holes, I just made a small fold and then cut about a quarter inch into the fold. And then I went to the other side and made another small fold and cut into it a quarter inch. Now I have two holes. Now you are going to take one of the two smaller pieces from before. Here, I'm just cutting out a strand about half an inch thick and 12 inches long. This is what's going to keep the poncho tied together. Now just take the strand of fabric that you just cut it out and slide it through the holes you just made. After that, just tie it together. And your poncho is finished! For this first outfit, I wanted a put together but casual outfit. I think it's great for hanging out with friends. I went with floral pants for a statement and bolder effect. I added a white button up to keep things casual but classy. I finished with black booties to tie the entire look together. This also works as a casual holiday outfit. second outfit, I wore the poncho without the bow tie. I opt for a midi black skirt. I kept the entire outfit black by wearing a black shirt. Then finished the look with a pair of black heels. I love the black and red color palette together. This outfit can be worn to a nice dinner or a holiday party. The last outfit is the most casual. I love mustard and maroon together. I went with the mustard pants. I paired that with a striped top. 
I added a scarf for a casual touch. I finished with black booties for a polished look. This is another casual outfit that would be great for the upcoming Thanksgiving celebration or just hang out with friends.